In the quiet world beneath our feet, where shadows stretch through unseen tunnels and life unfolds grain by grain, a silent transformation is underway. Gardeners often believe compost is the greatest magnet for earthworms, but nature, in her endless complexity, hides a surprising truth. There exists a humble ingredient found in nearly every kitchen that worms crave even more than your richest organic compost. This ingredient is uncooked oats. To us, oats are breakfast, a warm bowl, a comforting flavour. But to earthworms, they are a banquet of irresistible energy. Oats break down rapidly, becoming soft, moist, and microbially active within days of reaching the soil. And it is this microbial bloom, a delicately choreographed explosion of bacteria and fungi, that earthworms cannot resist. Unlike many kitchen scraps that take weeks or months to transform, oats become worm-ready almost immediately. They begin to ferment, warm slightly, and generate a scent detectable only to the remarkable sensory world of earthworms. For a worm, oats are not just food. They are an invitation. Compost, rich as it is, has already gone through much of the decomposition process. Its energy has been spent, its sugars consumed, its microbes stable and predictable. But oats? They represent a fresh frontier, a territory of new growth, new microbial populations, and new biochemical signals. Oats offer worms a trio of remarkable benefits. First, simple carbohydrates provide immediate energy. Oats are dense with starches, which are easily broken down into sugars by soil microbes. These sugars then become food for bacteria, and in turn, those bacteria become food for worms. It's really a perfect chain reaction. Second, the soft texture of hydrated oats makes feeding effortless for worms. Once oats absorb water, they turn into a soft paste that worms can ingest without any chewing, struggle, or delay. Third, oats trigger a microbial explosion, their absolute favourite buffet. As oats decompose, they create a hot spot teeming with microbes. Worms are drawn to these microbes, much like sharks are drawn to a blood trail. And finally, while oats may have little scent to us, to worms, they release a wave of chemical cues that seem to whisper, Come here. Feast awaits. Few gardeners, if any, ever see what truly happens when oats enter the soil. Within just a few hours, the grains swell with moisture, becoming a haven for microbial pioneers, tiny organisms that begin digesting the oats' outer layers. As these populations multiply, they send chemical messages through the soil, the very first signals that alert the underground giants. Worms detect these signs using sensitive chemoreceptors on their skin. They begin to move, slowly and steadily, guided by invisible currents of scent and vibration. Where there are oats, there soon will be worms. Earthworms do not run, they do not leap, but they travel with purpose. Within just 24 hours of introducing oats to a garden bed, the soil begins to stir. Tiny casts appear on the surface, those familiar little coils of processed soil. More worms arrive. Some come from just a few centimetres away, others migrate from deeper layers. By day three, an average handful of soil near the oat patch may contain 30 to 50 percent more worms than untreated areas. Where compost draws a steady trickle, oats create a flood. As worms converge on the oats, something incredible happens. Their tunnels grow denser and more interconnected, and oxygen reaches deeper layers. 
Worm castings, nature's richest fertilizer, accumulate quickly. These castings contain five times more nitrogen and ten times more potassium than the surrounding soil. Oats feed microbes and worms spread them, creating zones of exceptional fertility. Worm tunnels channel water efficiently, reducing runoff and increasing soil saturation. Within weeks, a garden bed touched by oats begins to look different, richer, darker, more alive. The process is surprisingly simple. Rolled oats, steel-cut oats, even old-fashioned porridge oats will do. Just avoid flavoured or sweetened types. Worms prefer it natural. A handful per square metre is enough. Too much can ferment too strongly and temporarily heat the soil. Cover with a thin layer of soil or mulch to keep moisture in and prevent birds from stealing your worm bait. Water lightly as moisture activates the microbial bloom worms seek. You'll notice more worm tunnels, casts and surface movement in about one to three days. Most gardeners spend years trying to improve their soil. They haul compost, shovel manure and mix fertilisers. Yet this quiet, unassuming grain something that sits forgotten in the back of kitchen cabinets, has a power few recognise. Oats are not merely food. They are soil activators, worm attractors and microbial stimulators. They awaken the earth. Where oats go, life follows. Earthworms are nature's engineers. Their presence signals health, balance and fertility. And the more worms you attract, the faster your soil transforms. Compost is excellent. Manure is powerful. But oats, oats are irresistible. A kitchen ingredient that outperforms compost in drawing worms from every corner of the soil. And now that you know this hidden truth, your garden will never be the same again.